think that door's gonna stay shut. Hey guys, Omega here with Uniquely Average Gamers, back with some more Transistor. Door two again. Draw anything good. Time for some keep away. So today we've got a little something different here. Um, this video is going to be all about the tests. Uh, performance tests, speed tests, survival tests, durability tests, what are they called? Just all of the tests. We're going to the beach, we're going to stay at the beach this whole episode. If you're not interested in that, well then my friend, this episode is not for you. Not that I don't want you to hang around, I just, I just want to let you know up front that if that's not what you're looking for, then that's what it is. Because I'm a nice guy. I'm just looking out for you. And if that does describe you, we will provide a link right here for you to follow on to our next video. Didn't take the link? Nah, I didn't think you would. I'm kind of glad, because I'd probably miss it too much. Not yet. So here we've got a survive mission. Of course, my go-to strategy for a survive mission is to kill everything else because you know that's the easiest way to survive be the last man standing the other the other thing that dictated that decision was um, all the fetch the dog enemies they are just a pain in the butt to avoid so I, uh, I decided to go aggressive best defense is a good offense right
even with Jaunt having the help ability tacked on, which leaves a ghost version of me every time I jaunt away, I've taken a considerable amount of damage from these guys. Probably could have done a better job of running and hiding, but uh, that's not nearly as much fun. Well, here we are, down to the last 27 seconds of surviving. I have literally one hit. I'm one hit away from losing my first function. And there it is, with less than 10 seconds to survive, I get hit by none other than a bad cell. Thing to note here, uh, <laughs> if, you, if you do kill everything, they apparently just send more enemies. Um, but I'm not worried about it at this point, three seconds, but I do know that I want revenge on that bad cell. So I go and get it. Here we go, performance test number two. Let me just tell you guys, this one's gonna be a doozy. All right, so I'm taking, I go for a little bit of a risky strategy here, and I stack Spark with Bounce, my probably all-time favorite, um, besides that with the addition of Load, of course. Risky because it is one function, and if I die, it's start over, so. It's early in the fight, so you know. I'm feeling pretty good about this.
So it turns out that wasn't too bad. Uh, my strategy paid off and was able to survive relatively unscathed. Next round, we keep it going with just adding Crash on as a second ability. So round two turns out to be some snapshots and weeds and that uh, spark plus bounce with the addition of crash seems to work really well. Uh, make quick work of those guys. On to round three. What do we got? Here they give us switch um, and I decide to stack that on crash. Uh, in retrospect, I uh, all right, all wish right. I hadn't. Because it is my only single target DPS and hits really hard on single enemies, um, but you can't hit them sequentially with it because they get switched after the first hit and your damage goes nowhere. So this section does take me a little bit longer because I am using the wrong tools for the job. But what are you going to do? end of the day I do get the job done so no complaining and so switch really doesn't affect me too much at this level and then they give me breach and I did say in retrospect sadly at this point I didn't quite get to that uh, switch on breach was gonna be a bad idea And it's right about here that it dawns on me that uh, 
my heaviest hitting move actually decreases my damage output because there's no such thing as friendly fire. But we're stuck in it now, so we make best of the situation and uh, get accurate with our breach and watch these guys duke it out for a little while. Okay, I didn't say I was accurate all the time. Boom! And a little celebration. For build change, we just take mask, throw it on crash, and we're good to go. Final round. All right, here it is, ladies and gentlemen. In this corner, we have red with the transistor. In this corner, the process. Fight! I do get stoked in this fight because this is one of my favorite battle tracks uh, of the soundtrack, so yeah, I'm rocking out. Why, yes, I do love Spark with Bounce. How could you tell?
and stuff. The crowd goes wild. Well, ladies and gentlemen, thanks for sticking around. That is going to do it for this chapter of Transistor. Be sure to like and subscribe. Leave a comment below. We always love to hear your feedback. Good to be home. Uh, you can always check us out on Twitter. We'd love to hear from you there. And that's the medium we like to use to keep people updated as to when we have new content coming out. As always, thank you so much for watching. We'll see you next time. Go. Just...